Hey guys, welcome to Wisconsin Wonder Gardens. Today I'm going to show you guys how to plant your very own milkweed seeds and get them to germinate. You might be asking yourself, why would you want to plant milkweed? Well, for the monarchs, of course. Alright, so here are the milkweed seeds and there I have another example of the pod. These were just harvested this spring because actually if you order some milkweed seeds online, what you want to do is artificially replicate the, um, the conditions that they would have in the winter. So you would want to put them in the fridge for a couple of weeks, usually two to three weeks. And just put them in a plastic bag and stick them in the fridge for a couple of weeks um, but if you harvest them right away in the spring they already naturally rent through that process so you don't have to do that um, and they're ready to plant and that's what I have here um, one option you can either put them in soil right away or if you want to get a plastic bag get some paper towel get that paper towel wet and then put these seeds in there for 24 hours that kind of helps them out will help your rates a little bit uh, but I'm just gonna do a couple plants here and um, I'm not gonna do that either if I don't have any good results I will put them in plastic bags and try that 24 hour technique as well but basically we just have some potting soil here um, this is more of a seed starting soil what you want to do is fill it almost to the top so you want to be able to get a quarter inch of soil above this once you put your seeds in um, so you just take a couple of seeds off here I got four of them in there four or five place them around in the soil Do the same thing for the other side no fuzzies everywhere Kind of tap them down into the soil a little bit and then we're going to take some soil put about a quarter inch whoa a little too much put that in there. get about a quarter inch of coverage over the top of them so we got soil seeds quarter inch of soil on top of that then we're going to take our handy dandy pump get that nice and wet and from here on out you're just going to put them under light make sure they're in semi warm conditions you want about from 65 to 70 degrees uh, they should germinate within 10 days for sure you should be able to see results in seven days um, grow them until they have a couple of sets of leaves or until they're strong enough to the point where you see that they would be ready to transplant and make sure that you have uh, regular conditions over 50 degrees uh, usually you want to aim for about 60 degrees outside 65 70 um, and then you could transplant them outside so they're they get a nice growing season and they develop nice strong roots so they last throughout the winter um, but you know just grow like I said a couple of sets of leaves make sure they're developed nice and strong indoors before you transplant them outside make sure they have a long growing season outside before winter hits if you are in a colder climate like I am and let them go so we're gonna take these here these two pots and add them actually i'm gonna put them right in here right in with our peas so i got them right there um what you can do if you would like i missed all of my plants every day so if you don't have time to mist, what you would want to do is cover this with plastic either use a plastic cup and uh, put plastic over that cup leave some air space in there or whatever method you would prefer ice cream uh, gallons work really well those plastic jugs uh, but you just want to make sure that this soil stays rather moist as the same with most seedlings um, 
and get these bad boys planted. Again, I said monarchs. This is the one and only reason why we're planting this. Uh, besides, I think it's a really neat plant. Uh, cool native species that we should definitely have in our backyards. Um, but the monarch butterfly needs, absolutely needs, this plant to survive. There's no way they can survive without them. So get a couple of these growing in your backyard. Please, please, please do that if you have not already done so. Milkweed seeds, you can either get them yourself or find them online. Thank you guys so much for watching. Take care.